Well, hey there, guys. Uh, like anyone on YouTube ever, I uh, did that whole thing where, you know, you say you're going to be consistent, videos every so often, that kind of thing. Well, as you may know, or if you're new, then better to you. But uh, yeah, that hasn't been the case. Where might I have been, you may ask? Well, uh, I may or may not have been working on something a little different. Um, that difference might have been in the form of this. And maybe this. And then also uh, maybe this. So there it is. I have authored three books, um, all of which are for sale on Amazon.com, link down below. Right, so formalities, or maybe not formalities. I'm not really sure which one I should be going with in this case. We're going to go with uh, not. So we're just going to get right in. Uh, let's talk about, firstly, uh, yeah, uh, Volume 1 here. So this is Volume 1, Shattered Legacy, The Mysteries of Fate. I'm pretty sure it's going to come across the camera backwards, but uh, that says The Mysteries of Fate. Again, we'll get a close-up on that. But again, yeah, this is the first volume of three, I mean, three that I've published. They were never supposed to be books in the first place, so I guess we'll, we'll, we'll backtrack slightly and go into story time. So, I wrote movie scripts, um, uh, I mean, I guess starting back in, what was my first official uh, copyright bit? I think back in 2019, that sounds about right, and I have always wanted movies. And so, you know, in the advent of just kind of the current day and age and just how difficult it is to get certain things started, I wanted to pioneer my voyage by having something a little bit more tangible, a little bit more physical, something a little bit more now. And so I got the brilliant idea to um, uh, write, write books. And um, yeah, disclaimer uh, for, for you know, everyone out there, but I'm not a book guy. I know, sacrilegious, I get it. But you're probably thinking, then, if I'm not a book guy and I don't know books, then surely these are complete and utter garbage. Well, maybe, maybe, or maybe not, okay? So volume one here comes in at a total of 500 and some change. Volume two here comes in at... Uh, just under 500, 478 currently as published. And then volume number three, which is my personal favorite, comes in at 424. So again, they're all full length reads. There's plenty of content and it, it's all still not done. So there's another fun bit. It's not done. The whole series isn't done. This is all just a temporary bit in the meantime. So Again, there's a lot I can delve into, but I feel like just for this introductory video back, I just want to highlight the coolness of the physical nature of what we've got going on and what I've got going on. Um, more aptly to that, um, these are a fantasy series, a dark fantasy uh, with, with notes of, of comedy, with notes of um, adventure, notes of, of mystery. Um, in a way that it's kind of a thrilling read, an entertaining read, but I wanted it, again, I mean, it's, it's I'm going to say structured like a movie, but in the best ways possible, I promise. So there's plenty of good stuff, there's plenty of meat and potatoes, and so much so that I've actually enjoyed the process because it allowed me to expand on the story in ways that I didn't even know. So to give you sort of an introductory bit, if you're interested in this sort of thing, but uh, the story follows the main character named Zaxum, um, and he's a pretty cool guy. A um, little lost in his, his in his initial bits of journey after kind of becoming himself. So reading the back of the book here, the story of Shattered Legacy follows the lonely ex-rogue Zaxum, assumed under the title of Lord, as right of Castle Deed Purchase. Zaxum is the chaotic neutral brown protagonist who follows his own self-serving interest until an unexpected, harrowing adventure derails him off his aimless path. 
His dark heart is eventually touched by an unexpected figure as he continues in his journey of personal growth and self-discovery. As Exum embarks on his grand adventure, he begins to acknowledge his own duality of purpose between insignificant and essential. The tale that begins with the solitary, self-righteous hero shapes into an epic of companionship as the world turns out to be a much different place when removed from the illusion that we are all the main characters of our center world. There are no shortages of twists and turns in all forms of the curiously unexpected. The fate of the world ultimately falls mercilessly to the decisions that take place with Zaxxum as both the center and the distant irrelevant in this grisly and dramatic action-packed tale. So yeah, there you go. Mouthful. But trust me, this... This is good stuff. This, you don't want to miss this. This, um... I, I've, I've put my everything into, and this is something that, that... You know, the way it's structured is every little detail matters. Because I want something... I want an, an empire of, of this. I want everything of this. So, the story that... that that's expanded in my head for years and years and years now has only continued to be refined process after process. So it was, again, script, an initial script, and then it was the refinements of that script, and then it was the refinements of that script, and then there were some more refinements of that script, and then there was a book, and then it was the refinements of that book, and then it was refinements of this again, with then one final rendition of refinements. I'm sort of a uh, perfectionist, borderline autist. So there you go. It's all for your benefit, swearsies. Sort of finalizing on that mostly again for now. I'll get more into the other books and things moving forward. But these are again available for on Amazon.com. Link will be down below in the description. Or if you just search SG Virtus, then you'll find this guy right here, or at least my books. And from there, again, I would strongly recommend that you pick up uh, some copies now if you're interested in this, maybe even if you're not, because this, I'm going to have a two week run here and these covers, as you see with the glossy fun white, or it's got a nice you know, soft finish here, but it's kind of like a creamish, silvery off-white color, is going to be limited edition. So once these are gone, after the next week or two, that's it. So get your first edition copy and we'll see you again for the next video.